What's up guys and welcome. You are watching Fizzy Fitness. So 7 weeks post Olympia physique of Michael Crystal. And according to him, he has lost no weight during the health phase. Which is a great thing for him because this will be a great starting point for the off-season push. Health phase is a time when these guys run mostly TRT. I think Michael Crizzo will surely crack top 10 this year. He is just way too big. If you plan a 5 to 6 months of long off season, that is plenty of time to not only grow that back, but make it wider and denser. The conditioning and the overall back development are the only two factors that can hinder him from moving up. I do hope he continues to grow those huge arms as well. There is also a wishful thinking that they place him again in the initial group of five to six guys and he gets to stand immediately next to Nick Walker. The seven times 212 champ Flex Lewis has posted a recent training video after a long time and damn Look at those calves, still one of the best. We would have all loved to see Flex hit the open bodybuilding stage at least once and potentially fight for the Mr. Olympia title. And I really think Flex would have been in the mix in 2019 when Brendan Kerry won. Even his 2018 package, the last time he won the 212 title, that package could have been very competitive in 2019 open class as well. Nevertheless, Flex has cemented his legacy as the greatest 212 bodybuilder of all time and his record will most likely never be broken. As great as Robert Timms' upper body is, he is still lacking so much in the legs department. And I'm not even sure whether downsizing the upper portion will help him on classic physique stage. Now, I'm not questioning his work ethic, but he is active in the military. So his life cannot be 100% dedicated to the bodybuilding. And that does play a role in your life. But does that also affect his progress in bodybuilding? Well, not that likely because legs have always been his weakest body part. Because if you guys remember, since 2016, the year Classic was created and Robert did crack top 6, even back then he had weaker legs. He was top 10 in 2021 and that is why he decided to take one year off to bring a bear package whenever he comes back next. His conditioning looks insane right now and by this luck, he is probably gonna compete soon. So hit the thumbs up button if you like the video and smash the subscribe button if you wanna come back for more. Thanks for watching.